Space Age technical ceramics developed and manufactured in Stoke-on-Trent are challenging scientific norms and transforming many traditional processes. We all eat and drink from ceramics, decorate with tiles and build with bricks, but new ceramic technologies are providing cost-effective alternatives to expensive or rare materials, even including titanium. That's why ceramic research and manufacturing in the world's capital of traditional pottery is revolutionising industries from aerospace to automotives, healthcare to the nuclear industry. Research teams and manufacturers are drawn to the potteries because of its existing supply chain, skills and knowledge base and the fact that it is already home to one of the world's leading ceramic and applied material testing and research teams, Lucidian. We were here and tested the new containment structure for Chernobyl. We were absolutely at the forefront of proving that this new containment housing, the first of its type in the world unique, would actually meet all the environmental and the containment uh, standards. And in fact, we developed some of the standards. On top of that, we've developed a couple of world leading technologies. We are the world center for the development and commercialization of field enhanced sintering. That was developed really, really on the back of a demand of the ceramic industry, high energy users. They needed and wanted a revolutionary technique that would save energy, not two or three percent because that wasn't enough, but 30 percent, 40 percent. Uh, and field enhanced sintering has the capability of doing that. There is a, a real epidemic of abuse of prescription drugs, opioids, painkillers. We've developed uh, an abuse deterrent technology which uses a dissolvable ceramic and glass which actually can prevent the prescription abuse of opioids. You need innovative people, you need dedicated people and a great available workforce. Stokes got that in spades and finally we're so well situated. Four airports, great rail line to London, really great location to do business technically and commercially. What else would you need? Why not Stoke-on-Trent? The company has joined forces with Stoke-on-Trent City Council to set up AMRIC, Applied Materials Research, Innovation and Commercialisation Company. It's a unique international facility that translates materials, processes and technologies into real-world products and solutions through the commercialisation of innovative ideas. AMRIC will be based at the heart of Stoke-on-Trent in the Ceramic Valley Enterprise Zone. The unique offering of AMRIC is the fact that it can help companies take innovation through to commercialisation very quickly. The Ceramic Valley Enterprise Zone is really midway between the Northern Powerhouse in Manchester and the Midlands Engine. And so we think by being located here we can establish some unique collaborations that would really help our companies. There is no other location in the country that has the same concentration of companies involved in that area or the skills relating to the people in that area and we really want to take the advantage of that. Global companies are choosing to invest in Stoke-on-Trent by relocating to develop innovative ceramic technologies. US-based Mempro has set up a UK business to drive forward research and development of its nanofibre technology. Stoke-on-Trent has a rich history in advanced ceramics and we make ceramic nanofibers which are one of the most advanced products from the ceramic industry. The potential for nanofiber is enormous. The technology involved there has many different aspects. The main one is catalysis which includes environmental condition controls and pharmaceutical technology. Then there'll be energy storage, advanced filtration, composite materials, and the exciting area of tissue engineering and biomedical products. The future for Mempro is very bright. We plan to expand the business and ultimately float on the London Stock Exchange as a leading manufacturer of nanofiber material products. In all of this, we're planning to do from our headquarters here in Stoke-on-Trent. It's clear ceramics will continue to develop as key components in the industries affecting everyday life. There's an awful lot of support for companies interested in moving into Ceramic Valley Enterprise Zone. Financial incentives, for example, £55,000 off business rates for five years. We see Ceramic Valley Enterprise Zone as being a real hub for advanced manufacturing. We're at the heart of the UK's automotive industry as well. What a better place if you're a supplier to the automotive industry. But we also talk about energy as well. The City Council and its partners are about to invest £52 million in a new geothermal district heat network project. That has enormous supply chain opportunities. So if you're a company looking into medical technology, Technologies, energy, automotive and aerospace, then ceramics is the material of the future. Ceramic Valley Enterprise Zone. Find out more.